Okay. I haven't dealt with that this entire fucking game, like the entire time I've been going back and forth between that spot, and, and then you go and fucking do that to me. And flash bang your ass. Oh, she's fucking <laughs> No! Nice, Doug. Run. Oh no! It says there's another med kit up here. I didn't see anything. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <sighs> Maybe there's one up here. I'm gonna go check real quick. Aha! I didn't hear the light bulb go out, but... Oh, God! Where did you come from? Like you talk in a Mickey Mouse voice. <laughs> oh, gosh, I'm Kenneth Riley. I got a nice buddy downstairs you could cut a piece off of. Just to get you ready. Just don't bother Minnie Wiener here. She'll be fucking goofy. <laughs> you got problems. All right. Unlock. Find me a signal. All the way in a fucking circle just to get that son of a bitch. Oh shit! <laughs> What kind of bullshit luck is that? That is garbage. Tricycle? Do I need a tricycle for something? I'm right behind you. No! Fuck. Oh, oh fuck you, tree, you piece of shit. Scarecrow, I'm the laughing wind of God. That's not good. <laughs> nice little Danish. Bedroom's locked. Then what's this? It seems like the reflected image in these mirrors can change. It's better not to touch anything for now. Okay, so that's a new. Um. <laughs> fucking shit, cock. <sighs> Come on. Nope. You did it. That's good. Oh my god, I forgot about the fucking internet. How did that work? How did that work? Oh, you son of a bitch. I fucking did not miss that. Wait. Okay, I was like, if the light works in here, that's full of shit. Also, more spaghetti and meatballs uncovered? That's a ton of fucking bananas. I feel like we're already in a kitchen once today. <laughs> Why do you do this to me? Really? Who who stacks shit like that to make it just oh, I have to push it? Okay. Yeah, push it. Push it real good. Okay, enough of that. Sorry. Yeah, the doors are open here. But I mean, that that could just be him walking through here too. Yeah, these weren't used. Come on, baby. Oh shit. Oh no! Did you find him? I can hear- OH GOD! <laughs> he faked me out. I heard him coming and I thought he was- But- <clears throat> <sighs> My request... Connect... 
and put that there save that should do it okay so i will repeat myself one more goddamn time because i want this clip bobbing for apples and eggnog Did the immediate clench that happened just now yeah that blurb sounded like someone fapping <laughs> oh shit all right we're almost at 11. Can I get a ninth? <gasps> I'm convinced that pe Sleepy Chip. Welcome. Oh my god. <laughs> How did they get in? 12 spawned sorry about that well, sleepy chip thank you so much for the follow welcome into the mob officially hope you're doing well uh if <laughs> yeah no unlocked windows so that's good oh you fucking prick i fucking forgot he does that and now he's in the fuck oh. god damn i don't know who you are out of there that's right fucking shit oh black hair and hazel eyes and I'm gonna go check cameras you are beautiful less than three you are beautiful less than three. Well, thank you. Appreciate you, Knox. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, my sound. I feel like this is like fucking Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty and I have to run back and forth naked for 20 minutes and literally do nothing. All right, there's gonna be something else here. Oh, why? Oh, fucking bitch. Oh, rat bastard. Watch like when you see her. Maybe not. I'm gonna get food for that rat. Oh, she's upstairs. She's coming down. She can stay upstairs. I'm busy. Nope. Here she is! No, thank you. Oh, she's is good. Is still over there? She's red eyes. Red eyes. You need to run. <laughs> oh, God. Fuck. oh, thank you. I'm like, why? What the fuck's going on there? Hey, everybody, welcome in, welcome in. Happy uh, pre-Friday, as we call it around here, or uh, hopefully not a Monday fucking 4.0. That'd be bad. Uh, but yeah, it is Thursday, as most of the world calls it, and uh, we're going to have some fun playing some indie horror games today. Uh, starting off, most importantly... Uh, the first look here in the Jug Mob to the uh, new um, uh, you, the Unreal Engine 5 uh, development style game engine now. And uh, it's, apparently, this is the way of the future for horror games. So, this game is called Don't Scream. And it is very much in early access. They've been making a lot of updates to it. Uh, as I've seen, which is good to uh, good to hear, especially when they consider themselves an early access, and it's I think the game came out like a week or so ago. Uh, so within our group of Channel Thirteen Horror, uh, 
we all are having some friendly competition. Essentially, whoever can get through this game the quickest wins. It's it's a speed run. The catch is that this game is called Don't Scream for very good reason. It's the only rule. Uh, if you scream, you are dead and you start over. Uh, however, uh, there is a timer that exists in the game that only counts down as you move. So the faster you move around or the cons more consistent you are moving around, the more quicker that time is to completing the game, I suppose. Um, but uh, the time that matters most here is from the moment we start the game until we get end credits of the game. And whoever gets the quickest amount of time there, I think it's a Steam gift card, which is awesome. Big thanks to Dolly for uh, putting this all together, by the way. And um, I'm sure she's doing a bunch of admin work behind it and um, reviewing. I know uh, we're using the VODs for review and all that. So, um, yeah, so che cheers to Dolly. As well as anybody else here that's early. I know that Cynthia's watching some uh, anime. I know the demon is lurking, but we got Spud, we got Chaos. I mean, there's always Chaos, but specifically Chaos is here. And there's a few others probably lurking around out there. So to all of you, cheers. <clears throat> we vibing, hell yeah. Um, so what else we got going on? Oh, thank you, Spud. What else we got going on? So we have, um, so we're starting off with Don't Scream. I'm assuming it won't take too long. Um, we are then playing Those Left Behind. It is a uh, it is uh, an indie game that we actually got a key for. And I can't remember exactly who we got it from. I'm gonna go look and find out. It's around here somewhere. There it is. Those Left Behind is actually from Woovit, so thanks to uh, Woovit for providing us that uh, that key. Looking forward to trying that out. I believe it's a zombie-type game. And then there's there's three other games that we could technically get to um, that I have from uh, both Keymailer and Terminals IO, but... Um, I may not touch those tonight. I actually am really thinking if we have time for a third game that we give, um, oh my God, the names escape me. I'm terrible today. <laughs> Absolutely terrible. Um, it's in this folder. Ah, yes, the Hotel Room Haunting. Uh, this game is kind of similar in the sense of... Um, I think you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to be afraid of this game either. I think you're not supposed to scream, if I, if I recall. But it's made by the same developer as uh, the developer behind Mannequins, so um, I'm excited to see how that's looking. Uh, as we may or may not know, Mannequin Hassler Storage is a really awesome. Uh, well, currently just a demo or a prototype that exists. It is free to play on Steam. Uh, it is an amazing uh, experience. You could play multiple times, multiple endings, and the game engine doesn't give you all the same jump scares. There's different jump scares every time you play. It's randomized, so it's really cool. And I believe we can... Thanks, Anonymous. Real nice yeah. Thanks for the bits. <laughs> um... I'm pretty sure they're doing the same thing with Hotel uh, hotel Room Haunting. So, oh God, as, as funny as this song title is, um, it hasn't updated yet first. There you go. Two, two arcs fucking. <laughs> Klein Mouse 90 hello, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the mob. Happy to have you. Um, I was actually going to bring up, too, about how close we are to 1,000 followers. And we are one step closer, thanks to you, Klein. We are now at 983 followers. That is 17 followers to go until 1,000 in a 24-hour stream. Holy shit. Um, so thank you so much. And uh, if, you're, if you're up for chatting, uh, I'd love to know how you found us here today. 
um, if that's okay asking. And of course, if you're more of just a, hey, I want to sit back and lurk, appreciate you. And I hope you enjoy the, uh, the content. <clears throat> now, what are we doing now? Let's uh, what I discuss. Oh, yes. So we went over what we're going to do tonight. Don't Scream is leading us off. Um, tomorrow, we're going to be playing. The only thing I think I have really on my mind for tomorrow is to play Buried, with his, which is Authogen's new game. Authogen has done Confabulation and Confabulation Homestead. Uh, the first game giving me a fucking anxiety attack. That was sheer terrifying. Cynthia, that is a great emote. <laughs> um, so let's, we got that going. Oh yeah, I was supposed to skip the song because this is like an interlude song. Here we go. Now, uh, so we have, a, we have a good stream scheduled for tomorrow. Um, I'm starting around 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to go four or five hours stream. So we'll see. I missed the question. Twitch has been ish lately in terms of buffering. Oh yeah. Also, I apologize for how loud that truly was. Oh, it's, it's, it's all good. <laughs> if that was you, the anonymous uh, uh, noisemaker, it's it's all good. That's why they're there. <laughs> um, and the question was, uh, do you, uh, how did you find us here today? That was the question. Uh, the internet is a big, vast place. I mean, Twitch alone is a huge platform. So I'm just curious to know how people kind of stumble into this little corner of Twitch. Oh yeah, you like the pins? That's awesome. <laughs> I'm glad you do. Um, so yeah, tomorrow we're, we're playing Buried and then I don't really know yet. But I'll think about it. Maybe we'll just play a bunch of other games, like these other games I have that we got uh, we got keys for. Maybe we'll play those, have some more indies. Um, and then we also have games I haven't beaten yet I can always get back to, so there's plenty of stuff we can do tomorrow. But the big thing with tomorrow is uh, one of the Jugtober, Jugtober Redemptions. Um, and that is the 2X Bardock uh, Spicy Ramen Noodles. So I have to um, cook those up tomorrow and I'll have them ready to go. We're gonna start the stream with it. It's gonna be my lunch and I'm gonna hate every moment of it. Suggested list, I fall into the CEO of Screams creator. Oh, awesome. Yeah, a great, great group of uh, creators, absolutely. And if the rest of you haven't checked out the CEOs of Screams, highly recommended. That link in chat will get you to the page. It shows every single one of us. Um. So that's tomorrow. And about Jugtober, tomorrow will be the day that our Halloween stream will finally update in terms of ad revenue and um, turbo payment. And that will have a full, actual, real figure to work with in terms of money that I need to deposit into Tiltify to get the total there. Once I have that, I'll, I'll obviously have the total, and I'll be giving that out tomorrow as well as part of the stream to say here's our final number for the year, or for the, the, the month that is. I guess it's the year. We only do it one month a year. But uh, I can say with certainty, after Twitch's weird uh, analytic issue with money, uh, like the reporting of it, and uh, the slowness of ad revenue and turbo money hitting, um, there is enough money from where we left off, right? When we left off on Halloween, the amount of money that I owe is gonna push us over $1,800, which is crazy. And it also means we're gonna have another Steam game giveaway uh, tomorrow. Not tonight, because I haven't done it yet, so it's not legitimate. So tomorrow when I do it, It'll be good to go. So again, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time tomorrow, we get spicy ramen noodles, we get the Jugtober total final raised amount for 2023, uh, and then we also have uh, a Steam game giveaway, let, al let alone the rest of the shit we're gonna be doing tomorrow. So that's in, tomorrow's gonna be the last stream that I'm going to be a part of um, for about a, uh, a week and a bit. Uh, so Saturday, I'm going to be in Boston for the evening. 
Uh, so there's not going stream then. That's why we had stream technically on Tuesday, but we'll call it tomorrow with the makeup. Uh, and then there's no stream on Sundays, like ever. <laughs> but um, maybe I'll be in Discord. We'll hang out. Actually, I can't. Duh. Because what's the next day? I'm heading on a fucking plane down to Louisiana to go hang out in New Orleans for the week. But then I'll be back on Friday. Uh, Smart 344 thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the mob. Happy to have you. Was that 11 EST by chance? Yes. 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. <clears throat> so, um, all of that's taken order. Okay, now, since Jugtober's technically over, which is a bummer, um, the biggest bummer part of it is that fucking number up there is way too big, and it's gonna hurt. That is, um... What do you figure? Like, I think it's 15. It's, yeah. It's 15 wheel spins with one left over. So, for those of the new followers here, or anyone else that's just show, popping in for the first time, um, every three subscriptions, whether it is uh, tier one, two, or three, or it's prime, or it's a renew, or it's a gifted sub, whatever it is, some type of subscription has occurred. Um, it adds one to that counter, and every three of them, I have to spin a wheel, which we're about to do, so don't go anywhere. It is a bunch of terrible things on there. Hot sauces, fucking spicy-ass peanuts, and cheese balls, and bean boozles. It's awful. Sweet. I now have to lurk and during my appointment tomorrow. Have Uh... Oh, you have a stream tomorrow? Oh, cool, cool. Um, oh, shit. Oops. I think I just pressed a button and didn't want to press, but that's fine. Oh, God, is this just not going to work? Oh, it is going to work now. Okay. No, it didn't. It was too slow. <laughs> Damn it. This So, I have a whole automated thing down here that I um I just easily press buttons and the button thing is like disconnecting and reconnecting every three seconds. So it's a pain in the ass. Anyways, let's spin this thing. Uh yes, okay. So we're gonna start us off here. Oh come on. Um we are switching over, well, I should say we are starting off the wheel spin night tonight with crack balls, Carolina Reaper infused cheese balls, lovely. They're actually really good, I do have to say, but they uh, they pack a punch. Yep, appointment's at 11, meaning I'll be in the waiting room until minute 25 after we have the specials back in the room for a minute 30. Yep, yep, hear that, Klein. The first wave of heat from these things is like, hey, <laughs> they'll let you know you're there. Mm. Oh, fuck me. Well, speaking of uh, terrible things, ugh, I mentioned the spicy ramen. Well... Oh, that's spicy, man. Ooh. Um, spicy Ramen was our $1,000 uh, charity milestone. We destroyed that. The $1,500 one just came in today. Not looking forward to it. Those are whole dried ghost peppers. And I have to eat one of them. Would you get those? Pretty sure my nephew would be all over them. Um, so I got them from a friend of mine who, uh, he comes in the stream quite often. He mailed them to me. Uh, his name is Satan 81. So if he pops in, um, I'll try to remember to mention it to him, but, uh, feel free to introduce yourself. Dude's super nice. <clears throat> Whew. 
okay. Um, I have to update my the wheel now, the counter, except this thing is basically broken. That is not what I wanted to do. Why did it do? Okay. So it should be at 43. I think I need one more. Hello? Fry! Did you do wheel spin from donation the other night? No, I don't think so. I don't remember. Fuck. <laughs> welcome in, Fry. Soup, welcome in, my friend. Hope you're doing great. Uh, that was should have been 43, right? Oh, this fucking thing. I'm so mad that this updated on its own to a beta code. I'm so mad. <laughs> oh. It is what it is. They'll hopefully patch this. <clears throat> that was my perk. Yeah, you and tree. How dare touch portal. Yeah, it's it's reconnecting and connecting every three seconds today. I don't know why, but that's the way it is. Actually, let me, um, no, fuck it. It's manageable. It's just, it's annoying. Um, all right, well. I got one, I decided to take three points. So actually, you know what? Let's just add them back. Fuck it. <laughs> add them back. <laughs> so th that, so I just did cheese balls. Those ones were for tree. God damn it, go back. Oh my God, I hate this. There we go. So that was for tree. This one is for fry. Uh, hello? There we go. Yeah, it's everything's super slow today because of the disconnection. So I'm gonna do it again. Spin chocolate. God, I wish I had some of that spicy chocolate. It was good. I would. Oh, well, I can have some candy. Don't worry, it's still a little spicy. <laughs> Come on, you fucker. There we go. The worst thing is, too, is if I change folders to where all my scene selections are. If I'm not fast enough, it brings me back to the main page when it reconnects. So I'm like, God damn it, having to do it again. All right. So these guys here, which are super melty, although they've uh, they kind of came back together. They're doing better now that it's getting cold out here in uh, the Northeast. These here came from Laser Lady. These are the Ghost Pepper Blue Raspberry Hard Candy. Um actually quite good i gave my nephew one of these and he liked it so uh just let you know client and i think we found these on the like, amazon uh and if you ever find anything at all and this goes for anybody anything you think should be on that wheel um get the link to wherever it's Ooh, being sold like the amazon link or something a piece of candy <laughs> um <laughs> thank you klein <laughs> uh in the not that I'm a money grubber, a money grubber or anything like that, but the concept to me buying hot sauces all the time is enough. Buying all this twisted shit, um, you could throw it into my throne wish list. There's a button down below that says throne, and um, you can recommend it. There's, there's things already there. You can also buy them outright, and it will keep your payment information away from me, my home address away from you, and it handles all the shipment and everything, and that's how they get here. Um, yeah, no, this, yeah, the candy kind of reformed a bit. It looks like it, it, I mean, it looks like it melted and then solidified itself, but this one is actually not too bad. Painted Gooses, welcome in. We're about to do a, a ghost pepper blue raspberry hard candy, which are not bad. Here it is right there. It's kind of bluish color. It's just darker when I get close because of the red in the room, but it's a pretty bright blue and it's a hard candy, a little sticky. Oh yeah, it's kind of gummy now. It's not really a hard candy. It's like a starburst. Why don't they make spicy starburst? Hmm. There's an idea. Hmm. 
Ooh. I was turned to eating a reaper pepper and it was awful. Ooh. Emperor Jord. Or is it Yord? I'm gonna assume it's Jord. Uh, well, I'll tell you Emperor. Emperor, I'm sorry to hear about the reaper pepper. Um, I have fortunately not had a actual reaper before, but I've had many things with reaper in it. Um, definitely not the same, but it's not good. So I feel you. Uh, I actually, it came pretty close. We ended up, so the final, the final number isn't there yet, but we, we broke over $1,800 on, um, our charity drive last month called Jugtober. We raised money for hope for the day. Um, and we got over $1,800. If we broke 2000, I would have had to have had the toe of Satan lollipop, which is awful apparently. And then $2,500 was a reaper. Like you push them way up there. But uh, I'm so sorry you got tricked into that. <laughs> Cheers to you, Emperor. Oh, okay. So I have caught up on the Jugtober wheel spins. And that is certain, because I only owed those two for tree and fry, which fry reminded me of. And then I got a ton more to do over the, I mean, they're gonna sit there for a while, because it's really have today and tomorrow. But I'll, I'll try to do a couple tomorrow, depending on how those ram, the ramen stuff goes. Shoes, my dude. What is up, my guy? How are you? How was your Halloween? I hope it was good. <clears throat> um... I, I, I think I'll I'll chit chat a couple of minutes here because for those of you that don't know this game we're about to play called Don't Scream, um, I literally can't make much noise. Like I could basically whisper maybe, I don't know. But I have to check the mic configuration and make sure we're good to go because if I scream and the mic picks it up, my character's dead. <laughs> so I now have that video of Master Chief, ooh, a piece of candy video playing rent free in my head. <laughs> nice, there you go. It's funny, I just saw a hardtimes.net uh, story. It's kind of like the onion, but it's just over the top ridiculousness. And it was like 30 something year old, uh, still recites E Bombs World clips or something like that. Dude, I was dying. Or oh, I play this, hope you have fun. Thank you, Lady and Red, appreciate you. I'm okay, I got a nasty stomach ache, but otherwise I'm good. Gross. Stomach aches are no good, man. Hopefully it passes pretty quick. That post made me feel called out. Dude, for real. <laughs> Do you know how many times I quote like pork chop sandwiches and half the G.I. Joe PSA videos? Let alone everything else on that website or new grounds or YTMND had. That was when the internet was in that still like that toddler stage. And it was just starting to grow into ridiculousness. Do that all the time. 30 something year olds, what now? 30 something year olds uh, still clipping, uh, they're still quoting E Bombs World videos. <laughs> that was my childhood. All those flash, flash animation websites of just putting ridiculous shit on the internet. Probably 10 times a day I quote shit from that era. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I just want someone to come up to me one day and go, who wants a body massage? <laughs> and I just die on the spot. Uh, Jesus. Okay, let's see if I can uh, get us rolling with a body massage machine. Go. <laughs> let's see if I can get this shit going. Okay. Hey kid, I'm a computer. Stop all the downloading. My mom, she got me a I don't know much about computers. My mom got me a computer. She put some games on it. <laughs> God damn it. It's my first time watching this channel. Do you mostly play horror games? 99% of the games I play are horror games typically. Every once in a while, we'll throw something in there that's a little off kilter. Um, last month we were, we had played almost beat, not done yet, uh, Return of the Obra Din, which is a cool, like, mystery puzzle game. And, uh, I'll play Clone Hero from time to time, which is, it's Guitar Hero, essentially. I feel like I should just go dig a hole in the backyard now. 
Yeah, we were all got called out. Clyde, I'm assuming I'm assuming you are in your 30s based on the number in your your name. <laughs> so uh, we all feel it. It's just three easy steps. Lick it, stick it, see you later. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. Have you guys seen uh, what I call a, a red handbag? <laughs> Dude, that one was fucking weird. Yo, you freaked me out. Whoa, with the faces like morphing. <laughs> Jesus. All right. <laughs> I could do this all fucking night. I'm going to have... Oh, then of course. I mean, it wasn't on E-Bombs World. It was technically on... Um, it was technically on Google Video before Google bought YouTube. <laughs> Emperor, thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome to the mob. We're getting fucking closer by the minute that is i think that's 985 followers obs likes to be really slow but i'm pretty sure it's 985 so we got 15 more followers to go until we hit a thousand and then and then i gotta do a 24-hour stream i don't know what the fuck i'm gonna do for that <laughs> i quote unforgivable a lot too yeah how long do you think you'll get in don't scream uh it's an 18 minute game i think i'm gonna get 18 and a half minutes that's about it. <laughs> I'm just I'm gonna fucking power through this. I'm gonna power through because I gotta I gotta prove to the world that power is not fearless. It's me. Speaking of fearless, corn's here. What's up, my guy? Like two minutes first run. Well, I don't think you can. I think what you have to do is that timer has to tick down, and the only way that the timer ticks down is when you move. And I, it's either 16 or 18 minutes. I don't remember which one it is now. Oh my goodness. Um, where the fuck? If, yeah, okay. So if you guys haven't yet, by the way, I'm gonna try to. Uh, it's 18. Oh Jesus. Uh, yeah. Please make sure you hang out with Corn if you haven't. He is also a CEO as a scream. Uh, you give him a little follow, a cheeky little follow over there. But how long will you get before you die? I ain't gonna die. First try. First try. Keep moving after the time runs out. Okay. I want a 60 minute version. 18, you constantly have to move. Yeah. Uh, so shoes, I've heard rumors from the devs that they do want to add harder difficulties where it's longer and a little bit more aggressive. So I wouldn't be surprised, but it's it's two guys. Um, they're just working together. Here we have, uh, is, it, is it Jorge or Yore and Joe? And of course, Teddy, because you know, I could see that Teddy does most of the work, though. Because he's a good boy. Please, yes. <laughs> 60 minutes and hide the timer. Ooh, that's an interesting feature I didn't think of either. The graphics are so well done on this. Yeah, this is the, um, so this is the, uh, the Unreal Engine 5. This is a big deal. Like, this is how we're, we're going to expect games to start looking like this soon. Which fucking terrifying oh boy um let me read this this bit of stuff here hello where uh well i don't know if it's ura or jorge no it's gonna be ur maybe it's ura i don't know if someone knows how to pronounce that please help <laughs> where you are angel just too many devs behind don't scream a big thanks for considering being a part of our early access journey Every screen you share fuels our dedication. Remember, playing Don't Scream during early access might come with some bugs and rough edges. This isn't the final version. By joining us now, you're not just playing early, you're helping us make it better. During our early access phase, we'll actually listen to players' feedback to enhance the game and plan on adding the following. More in dynamic score, uh, scares, expansion of game lore, optional objectives, Steam achievements, Steam trading cards, localization support. Uh, that's For those who don't know what that is, that's basically more languages lots more full controller support new landmarks and structures in the forest game optimization additional settings options and more please note did you check our minimum recommended system specs displayed on our steam page i did not don't scream is built in unreal engine 5 it requires a fairly decent system to run it smoothly we are limited in how much we can optimize it without compromising the intended visual fidelity thank you for your support and I think that's fair to say that too. Like, hey, like you got to have this. Otherwise, like, eesh. very terrifying. Just a warning, check your mic gain. The game automatically cranks it up, which sucks if you're a streamer. Interesting. Okay. Good to know. 
Before playing Don't Scream, please oh, play the game the way we intended. This means setting up your microphone correctly. Here's how to do that. You should be able to speak only quietly, <clears throat> not loudly, with slight gasps or sudden sounds counting as screams. If you speak too loudly and your voice exceeds the threshold of the microphone divider line, a red flash will appear on the screen signaling a scream. It's up to you to find a comfortable balance between speaking softly <clears throat> and what should be considered a scream when you calibrate your microphone. It's For optimal results, me. you should Jesus. determine the best distance to position the microphone <laughs> from your mouth. Gas too loud. Please be aware that I got Ali really audio good. software can impact your game's microphone calibration. Adjust settings in both your game and audio software for optimal calibration. Thanks for listening. Play fair. And most of all, don't scream. Huh. Well, that's helpful. Oh, wow. Uh, they talk like this. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Okay, how can I change? Oh, no, it's the other way. Other way. All right. Ah, ah, ah. Huh. Um, how about? Nope, nope. Okay. Let's, why don't we keep it at, keep it at eight? Can I talk at eight? I can talk. Nope. Talk at 10. I could, nope. Can I talk at six? I think I talk at six. Yeah, let's talk at six. Six? We all agree this. Nope. Okay, we all we all agree that six is okay. Let me get it really close. Get it real close. Let me get it real real close. <laughs> all right. I think I can. Fail horn. Whisper ASMR time. Yeah. Now the thing is. Now the thing is, how do I sound to you all? I <laughs> I did. Well, I don't sound good right now. Call the cops. Woo woo woo. Woo 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 woo. <laughs> oh no. Oh boy. My father has entered the room. Can you find your sounds like a whisper? Okay. So I think I'll just talk like this and then hopefully we'll keep this under. So, survive 18 minutes without screaming. However, there's a catch. Tell me it progresses when you move and all scares are unpredictable. How to set up? Use the microphone calibration slider below to adjust your microphone's volume output. Ensure that whispers are quiet speech. Don't exceed the volume threshold. That was a little off. Ensure that whisper... Nope. <laughs> Ensure that whispers of quiet speech don't exceed the volume threshold indicated by the microphone divider line. Exceeding the threshold of the divider line should trigger a red flash on the screen signaling a scream. Mind your voice. If set up correctly during gameplay, you should be able to speak only quietly, not loudly. Even slight gasps or minor sounds should reach their screams. This design enhances the challenge. Please play the game as intended. Microphone issues? Flashing microphone icon. Lower the microphone sensitivity via the slider below. This indicates that your microphone volume is being detected as too low. Adjust the mute sensitivity slider until the icon disappears. Okay. I don't see a flashing microphone icon, so I think we're good. That literally scared you. That literally scared me too. He does it to me all the time. Most streams. Okay. Um. Low quality, high quality. High quality, see how it looks. Controls. Move. Interact. Settings. On. Zoom in. I wish. Change that to right click, quit, left control. Genital warts are one of the most common types of sexually transmitted infections. Nearly all sexually active people will become infected with at least one type of human papillomavirus, HPV, the virus that causes genital warts, at some point during their lives. Genital warts affect the moist tissues of the genital area. They can look like small, flesh-colored bumps or have a cauliflower-like appearance. In many cases, the warts are too small to be visible. I am never eating cauliflower again. 
Thanks for that. Before playing, don't scream. Got it. Next section. Oh, you can select a different microphone. That's interesting. <clears throat> Let's do it. Seems like things are pressing well. Enter. In terms of drop frames and performance, pretty good. And uh, here you have the the final flight of uh, Leonard Skinner. I am not going to laugh at my own joke. Not because it was terrible, it was actually fantastic, but... I'm going to do this. I'm going to be Channel 13, Fearless. And the funny thing is, is I'm a CEO of Scream. I'm supposed to be good at screaming. not good. Interesting. I almost just cleared my throat and I stopped myself. This is just a movie. I'm not involved in this at all. You know? Nothing can hurt me. I can't die in this game. Well, I mean, I can. If I scream. Or I just won't scream. jump. Oh, I turned the flashlight on. Might be the radio. What? or anything. Do you want noise I made? Chair. Fart. old. It's that guy's fault right there. Oh, 
you doing, Baloney Boy? Play this one yet? What time do I have to beat? Got pitch black out in a time that I went inside the store. Jeff, I have to be very quiet. When of this game is not scream. If I don't scream, I win. There's a friend up here. You've never seen it, but you know what it is. Got a lot of attention. Speed running it. For me too, big friends. I'm whispering at home for no reason. Yes, we'll go. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. A for effort. Disconnected was here, he would tell me nice moose. Unreal Engine, along with I thought that was a bird. I think I was more shook than anything. 
and Moose is in love. Your mom's calling. That's not nice. Um, we added the fish, the fish camera lens. Like body camera footage. This is going to be the future of horror gaming. Trying, Fry, I'm trying. Blood Swamp. Right. Okay. He was having a bad day at work. That too. Shame <laughs> eighty one. Welcome to the mob. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate you. What, know this game? It's called Don't <laughs> Don't Scream. And I'm doing my best. I'm like halfway through. Inadvertent ASMR. I think that girl was naked. It sounded distressed. Thank you all for trying to mess me up with bits. I appreciate you. Well, the people using channel point redemptions trying to do stuff with those. So another bad day at the office. The audio was just, just a millisecond after her arms moved. When she moved, I was already scared. I was ready for it. Bro, what is this clearing? Oh. Oh, how are you asking for help without a head? Where's your head? Welcome in, Oodaloo. How you doing, man? This flashlight sucks. Camera's light, whatever it is. Well? What just happened? Die, Trump, die. Hit the door slam. Almost got me. I turned and missed. I missed the spiders. I caught them at the last second, and by the time they were gone, my brain said those were spiders. And I was like, oh. If I had seen them, if Die, Trump, die had not have done that, I might have, been, I might have uh, lost it. back spasm so hard how how I didn't scream I don't know those were your mom's traps what is wrong with you okay she wasn't heading the right direction oh my close one third of the way through almost 15 minute adventure My 
best to stand as still as I can in this chair. I don't want a creak. Anything to ruin this run. Two. Makes again the bits. timing. It's like Howard Dean scared the birds away, but not Jug. Y'all can keep together because competition. I don't want any babies. No. The Resident Evil baby. Nobody wants that. Okay. Oh. Again. You, you can't... No, you can't talk to me. I have no head. Doesn't make sense. I fucking killing it. This Hellraiser shirt, I'm telling ya. Pinhead's keeping me safe. Five minutes remaining. I'm not scared, I'm just confused. I don't know what happened. It was a cucumber. Okay, I s See that? Hyperion Sun, hope you're doing well. The last six, it's three minutes. Is so dry. Eat beer. First time for an ad. You're impressed, soup. Thank you for being impressed with me. I see you. I see you. It's the follow up. Tick Twister, Mr. Blister, Deadly Twister, Ron Daddy's Fister, Sister was Fister by Mr. Magister, Ron Testosterone, Zisted It, Twister, Mr. Blister, Deadly Twister, Ron Daddy's Fist, Sister was Fister by Mr. Magister, Ron Testosterone, Zisted It, Twister, Mr. Blister, Deadly Twister, Ron Daddy's Fist, Sister was Fister by Mr. Magister, Ron Testosterone, Zisted It, Twister, Mr. Blister, Deadly Twister, Ron Daddy's Fist, Sister was Fister by Mr. Magister, Ron Testosterone, their own sister. Imagine this in VR. No. I'm okay with that. What is this weird noise that's building in the background? And a warning coming up. And Chuck. I got this job. <laughs> my period, I'm doing my best to survive. Give me a picture of my card 5 a.m. tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, you will. 
what am I streaming for? I stream for four hours typically. I will be going till about one in the morning, Eastern Standard Time. Got myself leaning. I was beating the shit out of his ball bag. So there's two of them that really got me. When the spiders came back, I like huffed and puffed and it went the it went to the bar. And then that last one, my legs pushed upwards and I heard my seat fucking crack. Holy shit. Oh. You won except that one time. The second one was a super close call, yeah. Was anybody having to time that? I mean, I'll, we have a VOD to check later. <clears throat> I never saw the spiders that close. Oh, well, the first time I don't, I couldn't tell because I looked as like the last one swung by and then, um, uh, whatever. <clears throat> yeah. The second one, Jesus. Oh, holy shit. I kind of want to check really quick. Um, one second. Did this suddenly fix itself? No, it didn't. Damn it. All right. <clears throat> I want to go take a look-see. Let's see if I get a, a close estimation of time. Um, I also need to add another album because this is about to end. There, perfect. That's done. Whew, w shirt. Fuck yeah, W shirt. You got the, uh, it says Jesus wept. And then it's got all the different, um, the configuration sides. And on the back of it, check this shit out. Oh, you get a sneak peek at the fucking gray sweatpants, by the way. Oh! <laughs> Says your suffering will be legendary. I fucking love this shirt. This is one of those random Facebook shirts that probably stole my identity. And it's totally worth it. <laughs> this is what I sell my identity for. A long sleeve pinhead. <clears throat> okay, um, I'm gonna pull up the VOD and I'll sh I'll display it on the screen here so you guys can watch with me, but I'm I'm honestly curious
Oh, cool. One of our followers earlier, S Smart, was definitely a fucking <clears throat> bot or something. Getting whispers. Definitely get that question about graphics soon, I bet. Oh, well. Holy shit. I can't, that, was, that was a lot tougher than I made it look, I feel. Like, there was a lot of times I felt the scream in my fucking throat. Alright, how do I watch this strip? I think I have to go to my actual channel first. I went to video producer thinking like, oh, I have to go there. <clears throat> hmm. I'm going to click on this. Yeah! Videos. Recent broadcast. And this is this one right here. Perfect. Okay, let me display. Oh, come on. Brother, why are you doing this to me? I rely on you so much. Thank you. Okay. Let's see if I can find the exact moment. We start. Okay, you'll do it this way. Oh, it won't. Okay. I saw the options. Oh, okay. Let me make sure it's at the, f before I die the first time. Okay, yeah, yeah, this is the first time. I'm gonna get exactly as, oh. I'll set the play from here. All right, so I think it's here. I think it's like, it, it shows the game starting, right? So I'm gonna write this time stamp down at 45 minutes and 52 seconds. Cool. And then it, I think it was about two and a half minutes in is when I died. So we'll do like 48, I think it was when I died. Yeah, about 48 and a half in. Yeah, wigged out. All right, hold up. It was, it was the way that I said radio. Okay, that's interesting. All right, well, moving forward. <laughs> Almost there. I'm gonna get ready with the pause button. <laughs> Boom. Okay. I have unofficially 10752. Look at the face I'm making. <laughs> um so they actually it's about the same second. So the first I'll show you here. So it was 45 like that you can't fucking see it, it's too small. Sorry. <laughs> So it's 45 minutes, 52 seconds in the VOD is when we start. And in one hour, seven minutes, 52 seconds is when we end. So that is unofficially exactly 22 minutes. That's a pretty decent bar to set considering it's an 18 minute game. <clears throat> Holy shit, okay. I'm happy with that. Now I'm gonna go gloat a bit. <clears throat> oh, I missed it, damn. Tree, it was, uh, it was good. I died once because the way I said radio, it just picked up the decibel just enough. But there's definitely, um, I want to find the spot when the spiders got me. I don't remember when that was. Fuck. I'm going to have to rewatch it. Oh, wait, no, I think it's right there. <coughs> oh, yeah, no, she came like running at me and like tried to hump my face or whatever.
Where the fuck? It was towards the end. Oh, I think it was that. That fucking face. Yep. But did I make it? How far did it go here, though? Oh, yeah, I went red. It went right to the bar. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, that's rough. It almost fucking... I almost died there. That would have sucked. <laughs> right, I'm trying to switch back to the regular view here. There we go. Oh, my God. That is... uh, That's scary shit. Oh, thank God that's over. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the word on the street is they're going to be adding more to that woods. Like, I wouldn't mind checking out more of it. Getting achievements, secondary objectives, like, it's definitely going to be more, more of an interesting game as it fleshes out. But as a prototype, looks great. Looks fucking great. Um... They could definitely make the jump scare scarier. Um, Cause I feel like a good chunk of them were just meh. Maybe that's to get my guard down and then they hit you with a bigger one or like the double where it gets you once you're like, oh, and you go to start talking and then bang, it gets you again. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, not bad, not bad at all. Uh, I'm gonna fire up our next chapter for this evening. Give me just a minute as I set everything up. This is those left behind. This is branded content. Must check the box. And do I have a, I do have a woof it in there. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Awesome. Updating. <clears throat> I need some chapstick, I need some water. Dude, like, I could feel saliva clinging to my throat. I'm like, don't even swallow, just, just let it sit. <laughs> the mic is so sensitive, <clears throat> which is, I mean, that's the point. So, um, yeah, how much was that game? I can't remember how much it was now. I don't think it was that expensive. Yeah, eight dollars and ninety nine cents. So for under ten bucks, you get a game that is a great. It's a good um, investment to get it at ten bucks. I feel. I think it's going to work out in the end because <clears throat> you can have a lot of other shit that comes through. Let's get the game captures moved over. And. Need the audio, please. Okay, that worked. Cool. Uh, follow me. Can you can you work? Come on. God damn it! Touch portal. There we go. Adjust the brightness. You can barely see the. I was. I thought that said flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> Flashlight by the window. Okay. I can hardly see it there. You guys. I don't think you guys can see the flashlight at all over there. Oh, no, you can. You can. We'll leave it as it is. Scavenge and combat tutorial. What settings? All right. The important stuff. Oh, yeah. We get toggle sprint. That's what's up. Flashlights T, interact is E, attack, aim, survivor sense. Okay, all right. These are all good, although I'll th is anyone using F? Because I would love to rebind T to F. Actually, thumb button. <laughs> <clears throat> That'll be better. Save changings, graphics, custom. Fine, window to full screen is fine. It's just this resolution is a little weird. That's not it. There we 
go. Brightness is fine. V-Sync's on. Don't forget V-Sync, everybody. Max FPS is solid. It's 60. Uh, I don't touch the filtering. All that stuff's medium. That's fine. We can leave it there, I guess. It's not going to bother. Oh, motion blur, though. Fuck that shit. Get the fuck out of here. Waste. Audio is actually fine. Everything's pretty nice right now. Gameplay. Language is English. Yeah. Minimalist combat HUD? No, I want the whole thing. First person. Damn, you could go between first and third? That's pretty titty. Nice. Music while scavenging on, please. Health bars on. Yes, please. Okay. Uh, let's. I don't know what this uh, the tutorials are. I guess it'll be helpful, huh? Wait, this game? What about this game? Have you played it? Come here. Okay. It's very slow. Okay. The world is dark and full of zombies. Is it too dark? You can adjust gamma brightness in settings, graphics, display settings. Press E to continue. You press the T key to toggle the flashlight. Incorrect. You wear that your flashlight can draw attention. Turn it off to continue. Come here. Oh no, wrong game. Oh. If an item glows yellow, you could pick it up. Press the E key to continue. Use the E key to pick up the construction materials on the table. I can hear zombos out there. Great. E is the default key for interacting with the world. Press E once more. Pick up the shoes on the table. Hey, thanks. One tennis shoes. Press the tab key to open your inventory. Then double click on the tennis shoes to equip them. Nice. All right. These. Ooh. This is how you rank up enemy types. There's a zombie, a tweaker, and a fallen. Fallen are always slow, but are very strong and hard to take down. Tweakers are always fast, but killing them takes less hits. And normal zombies are slower, except during events. There's events? I was thinking of those that remain. Oh, I do have that game, but I have not played it. Dayum. Dayum. <laughs> so interesting. You can do... Increases punch damage, melee weapons break down slower, gain extra slots to your backpack, get extra time to scavenge, break barricades more quickly, decrease the range of noise generally while when breaking down a barricade, that's big. Reduce the chance you're flashlighting enemies, and survivor sense lets you to uh, visualize noise beyond level one of survivor sense. You can see in the dark, brother. <laughs> TTS dropped its bowls. Yeah, it did. All right. E to continue. To attack, hold right mouse button, left click. Lost, yellow arrows indicate the way to the end. Thanks. Okay. You can press left shift to toggle sprinting, press E to continue. Sprinting now, let go. Oh, wow, it stays that way regardless. Cool. E to continue. Sprinting and melee attacks consume stamina. Okay. Health is green, stamina is yellow. I love how it has thumb mouse button two across two different things. That's fucking funny. Oh God. Uh, okay, what do you want me to do? Oh, I see. I just realized something. So there's walk. I'm going to do the other mouse button. It's going to look like shit until they fix that. But like, this is regular speed. Oh, I'm a dummy. Okay, we're gonna pretend that didn't happen. 
just gonna uh, revert everything I just did. We're just gonna continue forward. Uh, <laughs> about that. So, what is it I'm supposed to be doing here? It's just, it's a statement. I didn't do inventory yet, is that why? Did that, did that, did all of that. Um, all right, so I'm confused. I <laughs> can't get is this the end of the tutorial? Is this how they do it? Do the tutorial and reach the exit point. Great. Fuck. <laughs> e. Oh, it worked. Took the baseball hat. I got Lucille. If the slot for an item is empty, then picking it up will auto-equip it. Press E to continue. Press the three key down and holster a melee weapon. Yeah, press E to continue. And by holding right mouse button, left click to attack. Press E to continue. During melee combat, move your character around to avoid getting hit. Think of melee combat as a CSGO knife fight. <laughs> wow, very specific. Press E to continue. You can hide most of the combat HUD by going to settings, gameplay, minimalist combat HUD equals on. Press E to continue. You know what? Let me see what that looks like. Because there's a lot of text over there, and it's like, I'm not even looking at it. Um, settings, gameplay. Okay. Minimalist. All right, let's see. It doesn't have... It's not minimalist. There's nothing. <laughs> I don't know if I could do that. Ah, uh, fuck it, whatever, we'll try. Oh, yep, kills are trying attacking from the side or behind. What? How did you hit me while I was behind you? Oh, she ducked me. What a bitch. <laughs> oh, yeah. That last crack was pretty good. Good job. That was not a good job, but thanks. Now pick up the gun. <laughs> there we go. The door to the next room will lower soon. Kill the zombie in there. Hint, headshots do more damage. Kill the zombie. <laughs> Lock pick, huh? Now, what does it tell me to do? There's a lot of things here. There's a lot of things here. Find fuel to power the generator. Okay. It's at the bottom. I saw it. One fuel can. Oh. Use a fuel can to power the generator. That I did. These are 15 construction materials. 10 metal parts. Five electrical parts. Five chemicals. 
Paint. Food item. Okay. Uh, beverage. Or waters. And medical supplies. Medicine. Yeah, okay. Makes sense. We got over here. Use the lockpick to unlock the box. Okay, so there's no mini game for that. Nice and easy. And we got some fucking ammo. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Apparently I had the code for that. Now I'm using slow press E to continue. Oh boy. Tweakers will rush at you if they detect you. Press E to continue. Tweakers make a gurgling sound. You can see it by pressing the Q key to activate your survivor sense. Survivor sense is a community perk. Press tab to learn more. Press E to continue. Press Q. Careful. Shining light on a tweak will get their attention. The wall will lower soon. Real quiet about it. Never know what happened to him. Oh, I have to kill the tweaker. Okay. All right. So that didn't go that great. <laughs> Could have been worse. Alright, I guess I just... Oh, that's a door. Okay. Another lockpick? Really? I have room for a lockpick? Anything I can do with this shit? I guess that's... I have to drop some if it's a... Uh, call it... Oh, I can't combine these? That's dumb. All right, I'm just going to drop those then. Pick up this fucking thing. Okay. Enemies are less likely to hear you in stormy weather. Change weather to thunderstorms. What's in the box? Oh, shit. Hello. Oh, man, how do I fucking... Oh, I didn't put it there. Oh, baby. Another lockpick. Anyone's less likely to hear you in stormy weather. Beware that breaking bear. Oh, God. Can't go near exit points, haha. -ha. Stand next to the beacon, press E to return to the main menu. Simple, all right. Game's not that difficult, it seems. New game. Save slot name. Okay. Events start from night four. Oh boy. First, or oh, hard mode. Melee weapons break down more quickly. Events are longer and happen more frequently. Please take more damage. Pick up weapons are less visible. Events start from night two. And easier is the exact opposite of hard. Normal's right in the middle. Perfect. Um, we're gonna call it 
Don't scream, champ. Use a fuel can to light a lantern or fire barrel. It will not be consumed. Okay. Welcome to those left behind. It's been a few weeks since half of all people mysteriously vanished. The sun turned red. And most of those remaining turned into monsters. Monsters are fast and ferocious during the day. Survivors must wait until nightfall to go out and scavenge supplies. Go to the book at your home base and press the interact key to fall to E to learn about how to survive. Uh... How to leave your home base. Go to the map. Uh, apparently, click on this guy here. And then um, a city. And then go to location. I guess. Tweakers equals bad. Gurgle. Empty space. Yo, what up, muscles? Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Hey, we did it already. And hey, we know this story. Base building. So, bedroom gives you a recover from tiredness. First aid recovers health from injuries. Bathroom reduces chance of illness. Workshop grants access to a crafting menu. Higher levels grant addition, additional labor. Use building materials to build stations. There are four types of building materials. We already we have a note them are. Station construction also requires labor. Labor is required by selecting the build job for survivor in the map tab of the home base management window. Okay. Uh, sick, tired, and hungry. It's traits. Combat stats, yeah. <clears throat> Each night, day cycle has four phases. Build and select. Select jobs for survivors. Select stations to build. Select a location to scavenge. Two scavenge combat and exploration phase. Prepare for the day. Select either the rest or guard job for survivors. Day, this is a passive phase. The player learns if the home base was attacked. After completing these four phases, you will be taken to the next night and start at the build and select phase. Okay, that makes sense. It isn't like real time. During the scavenge phase, single survivor goes to a location looking for building materials, essential supplies such as food and water and other items. Tiki to toggle your flash. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> yep, 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 yep. Events they get faster, more aggressive. Got it. Uh, go to the map tab, access this guide, then press the tab key to open the home base management window. I click on the map tab. Okay, well, I know where it is, so. All right, so now this is like the whole kit and caboodle here. Oh, these are the different areas in the house. Okay, I see. Nothing is cute to build. Here's our stations. We got level one storage. Unlimited storage capacity. Great. We got that. Oh, yes, yeah, so we can build. All right, we can't build a water filter. Produces water at the end of the day. That sounds pretty cool, though. We can build, no, we can't build hydroponics. There's food at the end of the day. Could build first aid, workshop, bathroom, or rest area. You're a caboodle. Well, excuse me. Why, I fucking never. <laughs> Whew. Okay, so we have crafting. Oh, you need to have a workshop. Okay. I got no points to do anything with that. Here's our loadout. Oh, these are different survivors. There's Davy and Zach. Apparently, we can get more people, too. Interesting. 
Wolverine, speedy, bottomless stomach. Hunger occurs more easily. Fragile, good immune system, high energy. College student and a nurse. Okay. Apartments, alleys. Oh, I see. You select the person and you go. Okay. Got it. That makes sense. So. Yeah, so we should probably do something here. Um, and there's only five of those. Okay. And we could build two things. I think it's we just build two things. Yeah, 15, 10. Or 20, 20. That's basically a one and done for the workshop. Or 15, 10. Or, uh, ooh. First aid. Getting sick, I think, will eventually be a problem. Like, sooner rather than later. But I think that getting first aid, if you are sick. And then plus the bed. Like, we need to have a rest area, for sure. So, build that. Oh, I could only do one. Whoops. I would have done the other one first. Oh, well. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and look around the rest of the house for anything cool. Building a bedroom. Nice. Okay, so that's just the same thing. Good to know. This is all the different spaces we can have different things in. Okay. That's the map. All right. So there's this different place you can go to to access that stuff. Random lights. Cool. Boxes. They're just empty rooms because we haven't built anything yet. Okay. So there's nothing else too, too crazy in here. So I guess I can check out the crafting menu then. Um, all items. So everything I have. Oh, well, right, we can't do anything yet. I forgot. But um, this is the oh, this is the home inventory. Okay. So you, this is stuff you just dump. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. Upgrades. We're not there yet. Loadout. I don't think we have to bring anything. None of that stuff, at least. We're lucky to have fucking shoes on our fate. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So. Davy is gonna do the work. Zach is gonna go outside and go to either this place or this place. So we got the apartments. I don't know what these markers mean. Oh, we haven't actually done any because we haven't checked them out yet. That makes sense. So we talked to other and told us about a route they established out of the city. We haven't heard from them in a while, though. I hope they're okay. I haven't visited. There's two checkpoints. Danger is moderate. Supplies at location. They have building materials. Some, some, few, few. Essential supplies, few, few, few. And then the other one is alleys. To get out of the city, we need to navigate through some alleys. Zero visits. Low danger, zero through out of three checkpoints. Build materials, some, some, few, 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 few. It's the same thing. So this is a lower danger. Let's start here. That seems smarter. I know they said to click here in the, um, you know, whatever. <laughs> Next priority. We'll go here. Yes, we're sending Zach. Health can only be regained over time at the end of the scavenge and day phases. Right. Scavenge. Return home before time runs out. To return home, interact with an exit point. Weapon icon is yellow, then that weapon type is active. Now, why am I looking at all this now? You know, we know about the events. Oh, this is the exit point. Alright, that makes sense. Okay, so that's not where I want to go, actually.
Fuck you, yeah, I got a fucking hammer. I told Death that, oh god, it's time for us to get out of the city. He doesn't listen, he just sits there looking at that photo of mom, hoping that she'll just reappear anywhere. No time is running out, so it'll be too late for us to go. Mark is red. Got some food. This is a good start already, I do have to say. Okay. Swing, dude. Yikes. Normal status? Apparently I'm not that hurt. Alright. Ooh, gas. That's big. Should I kill this thing? Is there anything in there that looks good? Oh, it's a big kitchen. Oh, there might be another zombie back there. Oh, no, that looks like a cop. Yeah, come on out, come on out. Rawr, yeah. Dickhead. Another lock pick. Uh, shut the door. It's like a cop over here or something. Oh no, it wasn't just a person. He even take the knife? What a waste. God damn it. Had me confused. Oh, okay. Got some food. It's got something for it. it sucked otherwise. Oh shit. I can break this stuff down. It's our building materials. Locks don't open. Okay, you got it. Can't take that down. Ooh. A Dwinky poo over here. Right. Suck a dick, sir. Ah, oh, I can't break these down? Oh, that's too bad. All right, let's go. Oh my god. All right, I can't take the gas, but there's a bunch of other stuff here. So this is, oh, at least it's decent. Okay, get up. Nice, some metal parts. This is good. This was a good spot. There we go. Now that's open. Fuck, it broke. 
I'm injured. Shit. Alright, I gotta get around them. Wish another melee. Oh, there might be stuff behind here. I'm so glad they're slow. Oh, let's go, baby. This is big. Nice. Okay, I'm starting to get the hang of it now. Oh. Nice. Oh, there's some stuff in there, though. Oh, it's jammed. I can't get in that way. Shit, can't go that way. Might as well break them on down. Exit points right there. We got four and a half minutes to play with. Just get as much of this shit as I can get. Tell me there's weapons back here. one weapon cool but would have appreciated like a pistol or something god damn nothing there all right well whatever that one's jammed Okay. Do I have room for one sneaky shoes? Bro, yes I do. What can I throw out? I have plenty of chemicals. No, I fucker. There we go. Nice.
I know where. Oh! Fuck! I don't have another lockpick. I'm really pulling in as much shit as I can. Another exit point? Oh, the lock pick. I got time, I can do it. Booze. Okay, well, you know. I ain't mad. Another water there. I, mean, I think it's this way. Wait, no. Wait, I went through this way. Shit. Bro, I'm not lost right now. There's no way. <laughs> Oh, I was like, what the fuck? Incoming sunrise, got it. Fuck. Oh, shit. I have to go through this store now. I made it. Okay, good. Whew. You set the entry point too? Dude, that's cool. I like that. So I'm just attracted to the light from your flashlight. Yeah, well. I did pretty fucking good there. I'm injured, but I'll be okay. And tired. So I'm going to hunker down and plan for the next day. So I just can either rest or be on guard duty. Ooh, okay. Not what I wanted. All right. So let's see. Tired and injured, my buddy, you're sleeping. What are the jobs? Oh, guard. We can heal very minor attacks regardless. Okay. Excuse me. Not built during the day. Okay. True. What's this? Oh, these are next level benefits? Oh. We have a solar array? Grants access to workshop level three, first aid station level three, and hydroponics. Oh, interesting. Barricade. Right now it's plus 40 defense. Limited storage. That's always nice. And then that's where you can pick where you want the next one to go. I fucking should have moved this to a different spot that's more like a bedroom. <laughs> oh well. Now I see it. Yeah, I think we can up... Uh, we can't because I toss those. I have no electrical parts either. Never mind. Still cool though. And I could upgrade the beds. No, we don't have any of those. We need more chemicals too. That'll be good. Let's rest and survivors recover from tiredness more quickly. If there are not enough beds for all survivors, the benefits are divided evenly. Ah, interesting. Okay. So how does one prepare for the day now? I forget. Select either the rest or guard job for survivors. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, okay, okay. And then map and just finish preparing. Yeah, there's nothing else we can do. That's it. Be prepared to face the day. We don't know what kind of threats we face. We can handle very minor attacks. 
Troll defense, 12.5. Barricade defense, 0. Survivor defense, 12.5. Oh, boy. The sun rises. Howls and screams fill the air. With little defense, nothing attacked us last night. Nice. They're both well fed. Zach's no longer tired, but apparently he's still injured. Day has passed. I'm going to get back to work. All right. Not enough food, not enough water. Oh, boy. Time to build and select. All right. Well, Zach is definitely not going out because he is still... He's a max health... Uh, oh, the speed penalty and a max health penalty because he's injured. He still hasn't fucking chilled yet. So he can stay at home and work on something. And then I guess Davey's going to have to go out today. I'm going to go back to the same spot too. Um... Meanwhile, what can we build? Oh yeah, the uh, we need the medical station. That would make the most sense. Let's put it in front of the windows. That seems nice. It's 15, 10. We don't have any electrical parts. Fuck, we don't have enough chemicals. Penis. Wait, what? We didn't have any electrical parts. How did that work? Uh, well, okay. We have a first aid station coming soon, so that's good. Okay. <laughs> we'll get one of these eventually, too. Oh, let me take his load out. I bet you that's how we handle that scenario. <clears throat> Perfecto. You, my friends, are going to want to bring... It's a high-value trade item. Okay. Yeah, let's bring that axe. We going to need it. Okay. Don't need to bring any of this stuff with us, I don't think. That's food and water we have to keep there. Hmm. What do I have for shoes? Oh, just regular shoes. Okay. And that's, yeah, they're not going to do anything there. Can be consumed to power generators. Can be used to light lanterns and fire barrels. Yeah, I think I'll just bring the, the gas with me. I think it's the best bet. <clears throat> okay, we have six points available. We can get Iron Fist, which is increases punch damage. Well, I'm hoping I don't have to punch anything anytime soon. So I think I'll hold on to that for now. Everything else is fucking ten. <laughs> God damn it. Alright. Let's go do this, Davy. We can do it. He's like, I'm a weak man. It gonna hurt. Time to scavenge. Oh shit, I never fucking... Yeah. Okay. Go back over this way. Hello? Oh. Oh, okay. There shouldn't be anything else in those spots, because we've already been there. Went through back this way. I do recall this. 
Is there another? Yeah, this is. There's another way over here to another exit point. Wait, why is the box still giving me that? Ain't nothing there, bro. I saw something that can break. Oh, it's that. Oh. Don't mind if I do. Oh, there's a storefront behind it. Let's go. I can't shut the door. I don't like that. Hatchet. Or shit. Lots of good shit that I need. Damn it, I can't... There's no nail gun or anything up there I can take? That'd have been fucking cool. Some ammo. That could be helpful. Uh -huh, I see. Not a good idea to disturb this area unless we have the weather for it. No worries. I totally understand what's going on there. Unlock downtown. There's a whole nother area? That's pretty cool. All right, I'll have to exit there. I got plenty of time to look elsewhere, though. I'll be able to find my way back. This other back hallway. Oh, I see. It connects it. Oh, it's time, baby. Oh, it's time, baby. What's up, Shuffle? Welcome in, my friend. Cats are in. Oh, it's time, baby. Um, extends past this wall, and somehow the key is stuck in it. I feel like I always see this clip. Tell Zeldars about that. If, um, hey, Twy, we're doing well. We played um, Don't Scream earlier, and I'm pretty sure my run's gonna win. It was an 18-minute game, and I beat it in 22 minutes. We went that way. And now we're just playing um, Those Left Behind, which is kind of like a simplistic uh, Seven Days to Die, like super simplistic. I'm having fun with it, though. Well, that's awesome. That's going to be my raid message from now on. Ooh. Oh. Yes, I need we need food and food and drinks. Yes. Hey yo. Yo, I just one tapped her. Let's go. Oh, there's a the drinks I need. Yeah. Nothing else? Okay. Remember, I killed you. The cats are shuffling in. And it was pretty... Yeah, so twice. It was pretty good. I liked the I liked the concept. I like what they're going for. Um, I'm intrigued to see... Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. I'm intrigued to see how they expand it more, if that makes sense. Oh, chemicals there? Oh. Medicine over there? A lot of places I haven't checked out yet. Oh. 
I saw someone fucking standing in there. I was like, what the hell? All right, so there's the exit point I took. Shit. I need to find more. Ooh, it's a box. Did I unlock this? I, I did. Shit. Oh, it's a dead end, isn't it? Yep. Shit. Yeah, this isn't good. I need more um, food and drink, I believe. I think we're short. Let's see what the fuck's in here. I've already been in here? Damn it. I can't even pick that lock if I tried. We've already hit this whole store. Fuck. Oh, this is where we started. Okay. Need a map. Need a map. How do I... Yeah, there. How do I mark that? What are the point of these fucking yellow things? The tape. Looks like tape. Looks straight ahead. I wish M works here. Oh, shit. Oh, there, there might be doors. Okay. Oh, it's behind the locked doors where the medicine is. Oh, that's obnoxious. Alright. Fuck. Alright, now we get to the next area. A look at the map again. So I have to go to the right. Is that store? Entry point, another store set over there. Jump over here. can't go behind this at all, because I th Oh yeah, because this is blocking the door. I can't break that down. Nothing over that way. Damn. So gotta go this way. That's like it's blocked off. All the way around. There's another door down here, and then something there. Oh. Oh, my stamina was running out there. There's was the barricade in the middle. Yeah. Oh, is that door unlocked? There's something in here. Oh, right. I dropped that. I can't get to it. Because I can't close the fucking door. Oh, yeah, I can. I just have to... I... Okay. Really? I don't have room for these after I dropped it last time? That's sad. That's so sad. <laughs> and I can't... I don't have another weapon to use here or, like, anything I can move out of my backpack. Sad times. Um, 
So that that explains the map for this spot. But I bet you have room for these nuts. Oh my god. Why I fucking never. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Um Something down here. Oh yeah, it's the other side. Okay, that's fine. That's clear. This we're done with this entire fucking map. We've unlocked downtown. Um, I guess we'll set his entry point. Sure. During events. Which are coming up soon. Both of them are tired. I'm gonna hunker down and plan for the next day, so I can either rest or be on guard duty. Alright, we got some good stuff. All right, 10, 25, none of those. One, two, and no medicine. Only that was enough. Oh, we have our med station now, right? Yeah, brother. Tired and injured. They're both well fed. But they're both pretty tired. Yeah, that sucks. He who's well. Yeah, they both have the minor stamina penalty because they're tired. But the problem is, is Zach cannot go out again. Not yet. Oh then we have a new fucking location too. Just moderate danger. I have all three, I have all three checkpoints, I see. People first start turning to zombies, construction crews, and local police force try to erecting walls and barricades everywhere around downtown to provide better security. It didn't really work out. There's a lot of construction and metal parts, a few of the others, some, some, and few. Interesting. Okay. Um. All right, okay. I ain't got shit for that yet. Uh, upgrades. We have seven points now. Hoo -hoo. Loadout. There's nothing in Davy's bag. Oh no, they, well I have the... Oh wait, I should take his fucking shoes. What am I doing? Yeah, and then I'll take the sneaky shoes. Oops. Put them on Davy since Davy's going out all the time now. We'll just keep swapping them back and forth as we need. Nice. Okay. All right, so yeah, so Davey will uh, he'll take the lookout, even though he's tired. He's gonna have to fucking deal with it. And uh, we're gonna finish preparing. Our defense is better. It was only 21.5 last time. Sun rises, howls, and screams fill the air. We had little defense, nothing attacked us last night. Nice, Davey's very tired though, that is a problem. We have no water and no food now. We've also discovered the media center. We received a distress signal from the media center nearby. They've asked us to clear out all the zombies. Moderate danger, two checkpoints. A lot, some, few, 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 few. Yeah, this is a problem. My man's gotta chill back and relax, but Zach is not any healthier than he was before. <laughs> we could build a workshop now. That's probably a must, huh? 
Unlocks crafting of weapons, armor, and lockpicks. Interesting. Can't upgrade that. Can't upgrade that. You get plus 40 defense on the door. That's pretty good. The upgrading the bed would give us plus two beds. Let's resting survivors recover from tiredness more quickly. There are not enough beds for all survivors. Benefits to everybody. Yeah, right. So that's why. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Hmm. The tiredness does what again for them? Why can't I figure out their fucking tiredness? What's going on? Oh, here we go. So when you're tired, that is a speed and stamina issue. When you're injured, it's a speed and health issue. Okay. But I feel like if Zach goes out, he's going to fucking die. This guy tires less easily, but he's already very tired. If we build the second bed first before we worry about the workshop, I think it's the best bet. It's the way to go. Alright, so this place is pretty much done. Um... I don't think there's anything else I could really get in there. So we're just going to go and put an X through it. Uh, this is moderate, moderate, moderate. They're all moderate dangers. Oh, God. Do we do downtown, apartments, or media center? No. I guess we should do apartments because that's like the next, you know, the, the, the next step there. Because it was the first of the t first of two. I guess we'll check it that way. Fuck it. What's the worst that could happen? the fuck? I can see that through the wall. There we go. Some shit. Gas. Food's good. Oh right, I never brought the gas I never brought gas with me. I left it behind. That could have been dangerous. One of them in here. That drinks good. There's gonna be more stuff in here. God damn it. Need so much more food and drink. 
All right, fuck it. Let's fight. Nothing on him. I don't even have a lock pick to open that. Ooh, medicine's good. Need that for our boy. Shit. Literally nothing in this room. Oops. Got him. Crude armor? And a lockpick. What the fuck is the crude armor? Oh, it's just... Holy shit, hold on. Unequipped, can I read this? Crude armor. Plus 15 defense, negative 5 speed, negative 5 stealth. Still, though. That's big. Holy shit. Oh, there's a hammer over there, it looks like. Why don't you give me that hammer there, boy? Okay, relax. It's not that big of a deal. Oh! Alright, so you knocked the door open, I see. Yikes. Okay, we'll keep moving. We got about eight minutes left. Oh, shit. Can't take any of those things down. Butt rush this dude. Fuck. It was my stupid mistake. Fuck, I forgot the lockbox. Oh shit. That's big. The lockpick, sick. More food. Oh, what the fuck? Really? We're about to we're about to do this? Okay. Don't be careful, don't fall over. Got it, boss. I think I have plenty of those. The hammers, too. Okay. Hopefully, I can stack these in five. Uh, oh, I have two waters. Great. Awesome. What is going on down here? I do not want to fall down there right now. Uh, 
That's not good. Oops. Door is jammed, remove the pipe. Okay. Oh, well, if it's just one, I guess we're fine. Yeah, see? No big deal. Oh, but this is gonna suck. They have to break all this down. I have five and a half minutes left. Okay. What else is around here, real quick? Is there anything else? Stuff I can't pick up. Great. All right. Let's get back to traversing this <clears throat> contraption. Oh, you could tell the woods like rotten looking. Yeah. Okay, that's fair. Oh, great. There's quite a few more here. Right, see you guys. I gotta find a spot to get out of here. There was a safe passageway through this building, but it was compromised. However, I have good news for you. You can reestablish it. Go all the way down these stairs to the bottom floor. Continue down the hallway until you reach the busted barricade. Fix the barricade and you should be set forever. However, be careful. Something evil down there. Because if you could spare the fuel, I'd recommend setting up the generators. Rigged up some lights in the hallway downstairs. There still might be a can in this hallway. Alright, that sounds like a job for another fucking day. Because I gotta get the fuck out of here. Fuck, can't pick up that ammo? Shit. I'm gonna leave that can in there. And that's locked on the other side. Okay, so there's only one way to go here. Well, actually... It appears there's two... Oh, wait, no, that's to go back. Shit. So I gotta go this way. Down or up. The choice is yours and yours. Never mind. We're going down. Well, no, actually we're not, because guess what? That means I gotta turn the generator on first. Well, I'll leave the can there. Fuck it. Two minutes left, we gotta fucking hurry. Jesus Christ. The whole the whole way fucking down. Nothing and nothing under the stairs. Unbelievable. I don't think we have the time for this. Shit. 
Oh my god, I didn't think that they were gonna be the gurgly people. Fuck. Oh, it's a point out. Oh, I'm definitely gonna need that medicine. Thank god I stopped for that. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm here, I'm here. Unlocks the hospital. That goes further up. Holy shit, that was close. Not doing too good, though. Didn't find that much, but something. We got bunk beds now. That's cute. Very tired, he's still injured. Yeah, but I need to figure out the day here. Uh, can't do that yet, that's fine. At 20, okay, we can do this now. Um. I keep forgetting about survivor sense. That's probably helpful. <laughs> Melee weapons break down slower. That sounds pretty important. But maybe efficient pack to get more shit in would be good. Because I've had to drop stuff a lot. And breaking barricades faster would be good. That's important too. Shit. I don't think we need more time quite yet. But that would probably be next. Do that one. And break it quieter. Yeah. Then what do we got? Nothing in there, nothing in there. Okay, good, 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 good. I'm fairly certain that body armor probably saved. Saved him quite a bit. Where's the map? Yeah, he took a good little beat in there. Alright. Why don't we give Davy a rest tonight and Zach will be in charge? That's what she said. <laughs> God damn it. Hi, Meg. <laughs> How are you, my friend? Oh, God, he's only at 12 point. No, 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 no. We gotta give him some shit. Make him all that good shit. Let's give him that and that and that. Oh, and the shoes. Okay. I exhausted, I bet. So everything went fantastic, right? Was it like the best fucking day ever? Thirty point five, much better. The sun rises, howls and screams fill the air. We had little defense, few stragglers attacked us, we held them back without a problem. Oh good. Davy's no longer very tired, he's just tired. Day has passed, I'm gonna get back to work. Oh, but this is this is the bad shit though. This is when all hell breaks loose. Zach, why is it taking you so long to fucking figure your shit out? Yeah, you stay back and fucking keep working at it then. Question is what? Uh... 
don't think we can upgrade much of anything here. Or build anything for that matter. <laughs> yeah, we don't have much materials here, apparently. If, yeah, we, we need building materials. That's the problem. That one wants 20. That one wants 30. It's 45. 15. 15. 15. 30. 20. And it's already maxed out. That's why. It didn't. Okay, I'm going to be honest. I'm glad I got married, but the wedding sucked a little bit. Oh, no. That's too bad. That sucks. I was hoping it was going to be a great time for you. I mean, I'm sure you're, I'm sure you're thrilled that it's over. Because <laughs> it's... You had quite the fucking experience. I say, I'd have to say there. Excuse me. Do, 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 My ammo. Oh, really? Just fucking move all of it, for Christ's sakes. Pistol. Shoes and that. Everyone left at 9 p.m. When it was until 10 p.m., we had to wait for our driver. The driver almost killed us on the way to the venue and on the way back. Jesus. For fuck's sakes. Why is that a thing? I'm sorry you had to deal with that bullshit. Oh, no, it's also bullshit. The fact that I just fucking took all this shit off and then put it right back in this dude's fucking backpack. Fuck. Okay. <sighs> Titties. <laughs> What's up, Liz? Well, Meg, do you have any, um... Do you guys have, like, honeymoon plans or anything like that? Uh, you know, Liz, just living the dream. I think we have a station. Nothing is cued. All right, because I can't. There's literally nothing he can do. So, what am I thinking? Fucking put him in rest. Holy shit. Get him all fucking cleaned up. All right, we'll get this boy to fucking finish up the apartments. Let's go, DV. Went to Disneyland the day after with friends and did Club 33. Oh, I did see your Club 33 pictures. They looked pretty cool. I would assume the Disneyland part was probably your favorite. <laughs> That's just a guess. I feel like it would be better if I did just, like, have my titties out. No, but... Yeah. I mean, I agree. Hospital unlocked, okay. So we're back here. The sleeping was my favorite and the quiet time. Ah, uh, that's, that's also a fair point. Well, I'm glad you got through it. And you're definitely, obviously you're happy you're married. You married the man of your fucking dreams. So congratulations, I'm glad you got you got there, you threw it. Now you get to enjoy the rest of your your life with your man. With your man. Ooh. Hello. There's the gas. Going to bed night night. Oh, night Liz. Take it easy. So what does this thing say again? Oh, fuck sakes. Sorry for being so negative. No, 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 no. Don't worry about it. You're just telling it like it is. I totally understand. So there's something... I have to fix a barricade all the way downstairs. I didn't fucking see that.
We're gonna run all the way down. My word. They're saying this. I mean, we got it. There's something evil down here, but like, I need to fix a barricade. Apparently, what's in here? Oh shit! Okay. You want know fuckhead? Hello? Oh, whoops. Nice. Nothing. It's outside. Fuck him. Do that fucked up. Any light in here? Light source? No? Oh, hello. A booze. Nice. So yeah, Meg, you missed earlier. I played Don't Scream, or yeah, Don't Scream. It's a new horror experience using the new, uh, what was it, Unreal Engine 5 technology. It was like body cam footage of you walking through like this haunted woods and shit. And the whole point was that you're, you didn't want your microphone to alert the game that you screamed or like made too much noise. And I had to speed run it for Channel 13 competition. And uh, it's an 18 minute long game as long as you keep moving. I got it done in 22, 22 minutes. I died once. Dear police officers, I swear I had to kill him. He attacked me. Oh boy. Anything but that. I don't see anything else in here. It's further down. It's where I was trying to go. Oh yeah, right, the fast fuckers are over here. Was that something on the ground? Ooh! Did not see the Beretta down there. They got two guns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't fucking hurt me from in there. Oh, this is how I fixed the barricade. Nice. I'll take those. I don't know why I had to do that, but I did. And you, yeah, that barricade's filled up and there's nothing in here. Of course, the other doesn't fucking work. Unbelievable. So I don't think there's much else I can really do here. Which is not a great sign because... We have four drinks and two food items. So at least there's something for each of us. Plenty of water. That's all barricaded. Okay. Oh shit. That's not good. I forgot the event is on night four. I think we should just leave. I think that's the smarter option to just leave with what we got. This place is pretty much empty anyways if I'm reading the, the map correctly. Oh, I'm- I'm on stairs, you can't really tell. <laughs> Shit. A 
electrical parts back there? Oops, oh well. Fuck it. <clears throat> I'm so glad I didn't have to deal with any of the zombies during the uh, event. That was good. So Davey's very tired. Zach's no, is not injured and he's not tired. So that's good. Zach is back at it. I can tell you one thing. <laughs> Davey's going to get some rest tonight. Our boy Zach's going to take a bunch of this shit. This man's gonna get... Ooh, yeah, he's gonna get this boy. He's gonna get the uh, baseball bat, sneaky shoes. That, yeah. No primary weapons yet, but this is good. It's a good defense. Can't do anything there or there. Upgrades, oof, nothing there. Loadouts are ready for Zack. Okay. Who gets the apple bottom jeans and the boots with the fur? You. <clears throat> Time to prepare. The sun rises. Howls and screams fill the air. A little defense. Nothing attacked us last night. Good. Good, good, good. Zach's now a little tired, but that's fine. He was up all night. <clears throat> the day has passed. I'm going to get back to work. All right. You know what? Let's send Zach back out. Zach's going to get work done today out in the field. And Davey's going to stay home and he's going to. He's okay, but he needs a day home. Yo, Sleepy Chip, what's up? Welcome in. How you been? This load should still be good, but. I bother bring I should bring gas. Um should bring a backup weapon as well. That might be smart. Oh, and one of those, that would be good. Uh this that axe is not looking great. Bring the axe. Actually no, because I'm gonna end up not using it plenty of stuff in here. Chung, how are you? I'm doing good. I'm just giving this game here a try out. Uh, it's an early access game called Those Left Behind. And it's a, a zombie survival game. I'm having a good time with it so far. I think we're good with this one. What do we unlock now? Oh, it is the hospital. Hospital's completely overrun, but if we need meds, we should be able to find a lot here. It says danger's low. It's odd. Right, what station can we work on today? Not you, not you, not you, not you. None of you. Great. Fuck. <laughs> Never mind then. Davey, you are apparently going to sleep. Actually, no, you're not. Yeah, you are. Fuck it. Zach can deal with it. A uh, few, few, some, few, 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 no. A lot, that's good. A lot, a lot. Oh, yeah, the downtown area is the, uh... Ooh, that may be our next move then. Yeah, let's go downtown. Fuck it. <clears throat> time is it? Oh! We're past midnight, shit. This time eats this game eats up a lot of time. 
not a bad thing. There's our exit point. Okay. It's blocked off. Just make sure there's nothing around over here. Why am I already running? Chill. Very dark here. Ah, uh, more gasoline. You have to aim really low for some reason. Oh, his ankle fucking snapped. Gross. Okay, I do have to go through this store. That's empty. Cool. Oh, God. Must be a lock, a lock pick, uh, safety box over there or something. Nice. Ooh. Another Beretta. Let's go. We got... Ooh. Another one of those fine baseball bats. Opening for some food in here. What the fuck? It doesn't open. F shit. This is the other side of this bus now. Okay. <clears throat> what was that? Oh. <laughs> it was a reflection. Alright. They're not scary ones. Nice. Took care of those little bastards. Oh, cool. Spot we can break down, get some building materials, and get something, some other goodies back there, too. This is good, this is good, this is good. Nice. Okay. I need another fucking lot. <laughs> Shaylin92, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the mob. How you doing this evening? Or maybe it's daytime for you, I'm not too sure. You tell me. Fuck, I need a lockpick. I guess I should be bringing all my lockpicks now. Damn it. What? There's another event? I thought it was every fourth... Oh, it starts on the fourth night. Oh, that's not good. Fuck, this isn't good. Close that door. When someone creeping up on me. I think this spot is clean.
What's up with the weird timer now? Oh, did the events end? Oh, it's not the, for the rest of it. That's good. Because there was two of them down here, and they looked mean. They were very upset. Oh, perfect. I have two cans. Welcome, I'm good. Sick, and it's 12 a.m. How are you? Oh, I'm sorry to hear you're sick. That sucks. Uh, it's 12.20 a.m. here, so we're probably in the same uh, time zone. That's pretty nifty. Um, yeah, I'm doing good. Just uh, playing a game that I got from... Um, uh, so I got the key from Woovit. And it's like a zombie survival game. It's a cool little indie game. Nothing too crazy. Ooh. This man had a fucking hammer on him. Well, all right then. Oh, fuck. And they could really, uh... What the fuck is that? Someone's in doing something in here. But there's nothing on the shelves. Oh, here we go. I have to remove the pipe to let him in. <laughs> well, there's nothing else I can really do here. Oh, no. Fuck, I gotta go back and grab that. That is... a beverage. Okay. Let's let him in. Give me the goddamn lockpick. Here we go. Alright, we're going back to get that lockbox. Fuck was it? Oh, it's through here. We got time. We got time. Holly, welcome in. How are you, my friend? Hope you're having a lovely evening. So we actually started off today playing Don't Scream, which is a, a fun little experience. And I had to speed run it. Oh, they ran all the way over here. I had to speed run it. I think I had a pretty good run. Forty-five ammo. I don't have a 45, do I? I don't think so. That's 9 millimeter. Make sure you stretch out those cream hamstrings. Uh, I will, thank you. So I'll do that right now. I haven't stretched in a second. Oh. Oh. That was a good one. Thank you. Well timed. Right, we're running out of time here. We're gonna get moving. Glad I Thanks, Meg. <laughs> appreciate you in the biddies. Do not appreciate the door slamming. It's rude. Also, why did I fucking turn the crane on? What the fuck was this purpose? Nothing. <laughs> why did I do that? Oh, uh, I guess I'll find out later at some point. Oh, fuck me. So there could be multiple events? That's what you're fucking telling me? Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, God.
Fuck, we gotta move forward. Oh, there's so many more of them. I'm gonna pick this up. Fuck. Oh, thank God. You fucking asshole. I'm definitely running out of time, though. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's really all that's in here? Fuck, all right. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's another thing. Yeah, it's time to go. It is time to fu- oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, I'm stuck on the door. Oh god. Oh, exit point. The fucking thing's in the way. Oh my god, I got there. Oh shit. Damn. Oh. Whew. Okay. That got hairy at the end there. Zach is injured yet again and very tired. Zach keeps getting his ass kicked. I'm saying. <laughs> Thank you, Father. So now we got the suburban neighborhood, which is a high danger. A gated community, we should be able to find a little bit of everything here. Location has a traitor? Yo, okay, that's pretty sick. We're still missing one checkpoint out of uh, downtown as well. So we're not even done with downtown. Holy fuck. All right, Davey, you're on duty tonight. Zach, fucking sleep, dude. Let's get the loadouts figured out here. <clears throat> Alright, my guy, you're gonna get the fresh one. Uh, you're gonna get... Gun, you're gonna get, uh... Oh, those are 45s, those aren't gonna work. Where's the... Oh, yeah. Go. Oh. That's ample. Okay. Good, good, good. Ooh, thank you. <clears throat> thank you, Shay. All right. Zach's going to be seepy. Davey's doing the overnight. I got 15 now. I can get even more packing. Or we can break it even quieter. That sounds pretty good. I keep forgetting to do survivor sense. <laughs> Fucking God. Uh, I think we should conserve weapon. Because I'm using a lot of melee weapons. So we'll do that. Then you can't do anything during the day. All right, we're good. Let's prepare and go. Going to bed, have a good night, pal. Hey, tree, take it easy, dude. Hope you have a lovely evening and get some good sleep, and I hope your Friday goes swimmingly. The sun rises. Howls and screams fill the air. Nothing attacked us. Zach's now tired, but he's not injured. Okay. Day has passed. Time to get back to work. All right. Let's see. What can I actually do, though, for stations? Nope. Thank you, Holly.
<clears throat> so we can increase the barricade, but that hasn't been a problem yet. Can't do that. Adds additional health at the end of scavenge day phase necessary for survivors to recover from injuries. So light injury recovery for resting survivors. Plus 10 health for survivors at home. Plus 30 health for resting survivor. Damn, that's good. And then we could build... Um... Oh, this is the bathroom. Yeah, that's true. So I decreased the chance of getting sick. But we haven't had the problem yet. Workshop is going to take a good chunk of stuff to do. But we can then craft weapons, armor, and lockpicks. So that sounds fun. Can't do the water filter hydroponics yet. But that's expected. Um, <clears throat> how much for this? 15, 15, and then all of those. And we don't have... Fucking any, uh, it's electronics, I think. How is that possible? Oh no, it needs zero. We have 23. God, I'm smart. Um, so that would leave us with five of those, 30 of those. Yeah. It's going to be, a, I mean, I can't do both at the same time anyways. We only have one other person that could do work. So what's more important, being able to craft stuff or getting a bit more health? So for instance, we're doing pretty good. I think it's time to build the, the workshop. Let's do it. Cool. All right. So Zach's going to be going out. Uh, no, Zach's going to stay home and work. Is he a big bitch? Davey's doing okay, though. Davey is going to go back downtown and pick up the shit. Zach couldn't. Health? Yeah, health is definitely important, but I've, I'm doing pretty well with it so far. And there's still a lot more stuff we haven't touched here in this map. Oh no, I didn't switch the loadout. Oh, I did. Whew. Oh, I was so scared for a second. I was like, what have I fucking done? <laughs> I don't have any fuel. That's a mistake. Paco, don't forget to order more fish this month. Lunch will be here soon. We'll have a lot of orders for fish tacos on Friday. Okay. I have a lock pick and I have gas. Fucking god damn it all. I really did it to myself. Less zombies to deal with when the event starts. Ammo, 45 ammo. God damn it. Ugh. All right, well, that took care of that problem. Ooh. Nice. Ooh, yes. And this is a uh, blockade. Okay. Go through here. I have no gas, so I can't do that. What up, bitch? Lockpick. Let's go. My boy's gassed. Alright, what do we got? Food item. Oh, well. May not have been worth running all the way back here for, but... Whatever. Food is important. As is the water. Oh, shit! No! Oh, 
Oh, I fucking hit the wrong buttons. Another lock pick. That's good. That didn't go too well. My status is okay, I'm just well fed. There we go. Nothing from you. My dude's tired. There we go. Oh, yes. Forgot about this. Now I can break this down. See what's in here. Oh. I wish I could turn these into building components, like use, reuse the wood or something, but sadly doesn't work like that. Oh good, I actually have ammo now for this fucking thing. I actually have quite a bit of it. Oh, interesting. 5.56 five, ammo? 3.57 ammo? Oh, for fuck's sakes. God damn it all. Let's drop that. These are really important. The gas isn't that important. We need a new primary, <clears throat> primary weapon soon. Fuck. God damn it. Oh well. I'll know it's back there. Maybe. Are you fucking kidding me? that big red dude and nothing dropped out of all that come on look a brother up at some point right Christ I went this way already, that's right. Okay, so we've made it all the way back here. Yeah, I've already went down this way, it looks like. Hmm. Oh, wait. I go further down this way? No, I can't. It's all blocked off. Yeah, it's all blocked off. Okay. Damn. <clears throat> but I can power that thing, so we got a tank of gas up here on the left somewhere. Where was it again? Oh, yeah, right here. How about this? We'll just drop. Oop. We'll do a quick... Oh wait, I don't have to drop anything. I just pick it right back. Huh. Yeah, that's 45 ammo. Fuck it. I'm probably out of fucking ammo on this thing. That's probably the problem. I have six shots left with it. Oh, God. Is it cold we are? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's getting cold up here now. I'm in the northeast of the U.S., 
don't know what the fuck that was supposed to do. Oh, I guess it turned the lights on down here. Thanks. I made it back to the same exit point slash entry point. Now where can I go is probably down this way. Safe area trader inside. That's fucking awesome. What, hello? Can I go up there? Hello? Oh, nice. That's lovely. One of these fucking places again. Is that an ex exit point over there? Ah, oh, fuck. Can't go that way. Oh, shit. Fucking tweaker. Freezing in Ohio? Oof. He tried. Yeah. Oh, shit. All right, that's at least a good way to get back up. Fuck, that wasn't an exit spot. Oh, no. I can't go that way. Can't go this way either. Those boards are going to break. Where would I go from here? I don't know if I can fight this fight tonight. Oh god, especially if it's gonna be a fucking event any minute. Yeah, fuck that. Yeah, haha. -ha. I'm inside. I'm safe. My man just topped me off with all the stuff in here. I thought they said we had a traitor. Where the fuck is he? <laughs> is he dead? Not the shelves over here or anything? No. Alright, it's upstairs. Wow. So I can only give him the stuff that I have that's on me, of course. Um. Yeah, take the ammo that I don't have shit for. I'd be a sucker not to take this deal. And they can give me in return. Twenty percent. Oh, no, still. Oh, wow. Compared to plus fifteen. I already have sneaky shoes. That's pretty cool. Sounds Beretta. But I think this would be smart to get because a mine is about to die. And, um... Let's see. What else can I get out of him? Okay. No way. You've got to give me more, much more than that. Okay. Yeah, okay, I can accept that. Nice! Nope, okay, not the ammo. I'm just trying. <laughs> uh, alright, cool. Let's trade it. Nice. Okay. I can't unequip it because I'm full. Oh, fuck, I didn't think of that. Oh, no. I can do that at least. 
and I can go back here. And uh, what do you want for this? How about some ammo? Oh, wow. Uh, I guess I can top those off. Or these. Oh, yeah, the chemicals. Yeah, the chemicals are rare. Logical parts isn't a bad deal either. Let's see. Nope. Alright, that's fair. Let's do it. <clears throat> Alright. Good. You shoot from up there? Ah, uh, that's a good question. Oh, you mean from up where the, I was walking earlier? I should be able to. I just didn't... I don't have much ammo left. That's the problem. I only have six shots. Oh, shit. That timer's been running this whole time. But that's cool that there's a fucking traitor in here. Oh, well, I, I got more ammo for it anyways. Can't aim it in here though. <laughs> Alright, cool. That's cool shit. I'm I'm cool with how that works out. And it is time to get the fuck out of here. Yep. We done. Get out. <laughs> Woohoo ammo. Yes, now what I gotta do is the next time I go in there, I'm gonna I'm gonna load my backpack up with shit that I can sell to that dude. Or at least trade. Zach is very tired, but he's not injured, so that's good. Oh, it's time, baby. It's time, baby. The heavy hand swings is here. Heavy, my boy. Welcome in, friend. so bad chamber <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was nice <laughs> maybe he'll have different stuff yeah it's also true Ooh, thank you to whoever just threw out the shout out to heavy hand swings <laughs> I know I didn't do that <gasps> and Riz is here hello and yeah, Twy is always lurking <laughs> Twas you. Oh, well, thank you, Riz. Appreciate it. One of these days, they're going to have to build an API for that so I can just have a button that does it automatically. But yeah, drop heavy hand swings to follow if you haven't yet. That guy is fucking awesome. Amazing human being, variety streamer, and he's, uh, he's, he's pretty easy to look at. All right. <laughs> what in the fuck, Kois? Holy shit. Man just dropped 10 fucking gift subs. Gothapire, Sleepy Chip, Tellus233, Endeavor Endeavor, Evie Plum, Miss Mad Duck, Kareen, Mustache Mickey, Phoenix, and Baja Blessed all got one. Holy fuck. All right, just for Kois, we're going to spin a fucking wheel. How about that? Just for you, bud. We're going to spin that wheel. Let me in. No, it's something I wanted. Fuck. Sorry, my uh, touch portal is being a bitch today. Um, this reconnect disconnect thing. Anyways, here we go. We're spinning it. Uh, didn't want to work because things are slow and dumb. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go now. Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Oh. Oh, God. 
It's worse than hot sauce. Alright. We're gonna do it, but we're gonna wrap this game. <laughs> so I 100% didn't come along on my own raid. Nice. Oh no, not the old nut. <laughs> yeah. Um, how about this? We're gonna, um, we'll come right back to that, I promise. I'm just gonna wrap up this, uh, what we're doing right here. I want to see what the crafting was like. Okay. Can't really make much of anything right now. Hammer and hatchet. Okay, well, that's still cool. Uh, 20 points. Uh... Flashlight filter? Reduce the chance of your flashlight alerting enemies. Survivor sense, I gotta start using that more for me to actually use that. Break it faster, sounds good. And more time wouldn't be too bad either. Okay. Load out, who's going tonight? Who's who's watching? Davey is for sure, even though he's the most hurt. Um. Okay. Davey's the most hurt, but he's good to go here with the shit that he has. Um, Zach's gonna chill. Nothing new in the journal to be looking at here. Alright, finish preparing. Sun rises. Howls and screams fill the air. Nothing attacked. Both boys are tired. And, uh, only got to eat two out of four waters. Interesting. Alright. So this, I don't know if this actually saves or not, but we're on to night seven. I wonder what happens if I back to main menu. Like, is th does this save? I hope it auto saves. Should be night seven. All right, cool, it does. Nice. All right, great. So we are going to stop with the game there. However, because Kois comes in here and just drops fucking bombs, um, I'm gonna have to do the fucking death nut, which means I'm probably gonna have to have a beer at about one o'clock in the morning to make this fucking go away. Um, how much water do I have? Maybe half a Yeti. I got plenty of ice in there, though. Uh, fuck, fuck, fuckity fuck. Uh, this may, this may be the one that hurts me. I may, you guys may see me feel this tomorrow. By the way, for everyone that's here, um, we are streaming tomorrow during the day, another rare day stream. Um, I am off work tomorrow. Thank you, Cynthia. And um, I will be on at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. We are gonna be playing, yeah, what, daytime? Yes. We're gonna be playing Buried, which is the new game from Authogen. It's a shorter game, but I'm very excited to be playing it. Um, there's a lot of other games we can be we could be playing. I wanted to save some time tonight, but we did. I actually got. I was actually really, sincerely like really working on um. Those left behind. I actually was kind of enjoying that game, but uh, the Mannequin Hessler Storage uh, developer came out with a an in between game uh, called Hotel Room Haunting. It's a shorter game that he's working on on the side of Mannequin. Um, so we'll be trying that out tomorrow, I think. Uh, and then there's a ton of other games from Itch I haven't played. There's a ton of other games I got keys from, uh, similar to that of those left behind. Um, let me switch to just chatting, or I forget. Um, but yeah, it, essentially, 
we got a whole smorgasbord of stuff going on tomorrow. I'm gonna be on for four or five hours, maybe a little bit longer. We'll see what what happens. Um, but yeah, I'm I am excited to have a day stream tomorrow. It will be the last stream ahead of my vacation next week. Um, and I also will be announcing the Jugtober final donation figure tomorrow, since ad revenue will finally give me a number tomorrow. Um, hmm. Excuse me. Um, and we're also going to be doing the uh, the spicy ramen noodle challenge tomorrow to start off stream, so that'll be good. And I got plenty of these fucking things to go over here. It's probably down to 48 because I'm about to do one. So, anyways. Hopefully that helps me. <laughs> uh, okay. Here we go. Death Nut number four. These guys are miserable, but not as miserable as what I'm about to be. I can promise you that. But the good news is, is it's not number five, because number five has Pepper X on it, which as of what, two weeks ago? Maybe three weeks ago? Um, pepper X is now considered the spiciest pepper on the fucking planet by Guinness World Records. So there you go. Uh, but this is the old death nut before Pepper X came out. And it's, as you can see, it's just, it's, the peanuts obviously fall in like halves. Um, but you can see here, you got like the middle piece in there and then you flip it around. And there's some gross coating on that, and it's it's not happy. And uh, and these peanuts definitely um, they softened up pretty quickly, if I do so recall. So I'm gonna crack my beer. Hello. There we go. <laughs> Nothing says great decisions like a spicy peanut and a pumpkin pie sour beer at one o'clock in the morning. These are old nuts. <laughs> Oh my god, Twy. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. <laughs> Two weeks, NPR has an article about the Guinness record on October 19th. Thank you, Kois. I <laughs> see someone's out there fact-checking me. All right. This one's for Kois. Thanks, bud. Oh, it's not an old one. It's good. <laughs> oh my god oh the whole right side of my mouth just went numb Ugh. no of course there's no luck here man Ugh. oh Oh, holy shit. See what they ne I neglected to tell you is while Pepper X is not on this peanut, you know what it is? The Carolina Reaper, the former Guinness World Record holder for the hottest pepper in the world. Ugh. Oh my God. Uh, by the way, as I'm sitting here and slowly dying, if you are here watching this and you haven't followed on Twitch and you're enjoying the content, I welcome you to go ahead and do that. We are at 987 followers. We are 13 followers away from hitting a thousand, a thousand jug mobsters in the jug mob, of which. When we hit 1,000, <clears throat> I will be scheduling out a 24-hour stream. The first of, well, I should say the first 24-hour stream I've ever done. Ugh. Me if I ate that? <laughs> Dead. 
it uh it hurts i'm not gonna lie um so Oh, I was telling Channel 13 what uh, timing I got. I, I was told, good time, or is it? I better got a good time and don't scream. I thought I did good. Uh, basically, for those who don't know what don't scream is, it's a, a horror experience on the... Uh, oh, the Unreal Engine 5, the new one. Uh, and um, it's a timer ticks down from 18 minutes only when you're moving. And it's you walking through a woods and finding creepy shit and his jump scares. And if you scream, your character dies. <clears throat> Unfortunately, we'll be missing the daytime stream tomorrow because I didn't get my new place set up in time. We'll have to work in the office. That's okay, Riz. I mean, that's a bummer that you have to go into the office on a Friday. <clears throat> but don't don't worry about it. You don't have, to, don't have to apologize or anything like that. Not that you did. <laughs> but, uh, oh my God. Sorry, I'm just like, my brain is not functioning properly. <clears throat> well, Twy, I died once because I was whispering and said radio, and just the way that like I enunciated the A in radio, it just was like, nope, and it went right over. So it's an 18 minute long game. I got it done in 22 minutes. Ugh. Oh, just trying to my mind off something else. Damn, GG. Thank you. Don't scream. I'm interested to see what they do with it. It's honestly kind of boring right now. Yeah, it's it's a good prototype. There were two scares that got me really good, and like I held on to one of them. It like got up to the top of the meter and dropped back. I'm surprised it didn't get me. But yeah, they're going to be adding like achievements and um, secondary objectives, uh, more lore. Uh, so I'm intrigued. And they're going to give like, uh, oh, there's going to be like different difficulties too they want to do. So like they'll be longer. Yeah, I could probably make a better scream detector. <laughs> oh. God, this is rough. And these objectives in lore for sure. Random wandering while it throws the same jump scare so you get sold quick. Yeah. That's why I did it until I got to the end credits. Once I did. Because that was the challenge. Just get from starting the game to the end credits. Regardless of how many restarts in the middle. <clears throat> Whether or not I got the fastest time for Channel 13. That remains to be seen. Ugh. <sighs> cockpit jump scare? No, I found the cockpit and I walked around it. I didn't go in there though. <clears throat> Damn. <sighs> While I'm trying to cool down my mouth here, let me see who's on. Uh, uh. You need to play the cassette player to the end, then turn around. It's rude now that I've told you about it, though. <laughs> right. Not a big deal. <clears throat> 
it's an interesting experience. I will say that. Um, because quite honestly, I don't think I was going to get it until Dolly from Channel Thirteen set this up, and I was like, "All right, fuck it." <clears throat> it wasn't bad. I mean, it was like I think it was nine nine dollars in tax. So hopefully, it's a good investment. <clears throat> oh, I'm getting the shivers now from the adrenaline. <sighs> By the way, those didn't see earlier. For hitting one thousand five hundred dollars in Jugtober. I ordered these. They already came in. Whole ghost pepper, chili peppers. <sighs> Not going to be good. I have to eat one of them. <sighs> Tomorrow is going to be the easier out of all four of the spicy challenges I threw in there. And that is the 2x spicy ramen noodles. Then there's the reap. Uh, sorry. Then there's the ghost pepper. Fortunately, we didn't break two thousand dollars this year, <laughs> which means I didn't have to order a toe of Satan lollipop, which are terrible. Apparently, Ugh. as was that burp. And then twenty five hundred dollars was a stretch goal, and that was a dried Carolina Reaper. <clears throat> Oh. oh, shit. I feel like I'm starting to sweat. <laughs> Even though I feel cold, it's a cold sweat. Oh, my God. Oh. My word. <clears throat> My goodness. Okay. I think we're we're making the uh the right moves here. Oh. Uh, I gotta figure out who the hell we're gonna raid. Yeah, it's the Hey, speaking of Dolly, I said her name three times and she shows up. What's up, Dolly? Welcome in. Thank you for the biddies. I'm a freaking beast. I <clears throat> should I take that as an insult or a... <laughs> I'm kidding. Thank you, I guess. Before you go, have some biddies. Thank you. Oh, cold? Yeah, I'm cold and hot. I just ate a spicy peanut. And I have like the adrenaline chills, plus it's actually cold. But I'm like, I'm almost sweating. Flu? No. <laughs> yeah, oh. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> Physically, I'm doing okay. Mentally and emotionally is a different story. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> so, so Dolly, since you're having to put you on the spot, for um, Don't Scream, is 22 minutes not the fastest? Is some, did someone already beat my time? Or did I just not beat somebody's time this more? Maybe? Oh, come on. <laughs> <clears throat> oh. Jesus. Oh, all right, go away. Please go away. Oh. <sighs> okay, so... Um, tomorrow's stream, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, if you can make it, that'd be awesome. Come on through, hang out with me. We're going to be playing Buried tomorrow to start off, start off the new Authogen game, the guy behind the Confabulation universe. Um, I'm going to be giving the Hotel Room Haunting a try. Uh, that's the Mannequin Hessler Storage uh, developer's new game. And then there's a ton of other things I could be playing. So uh, come ready for some variety tomorrow. Probably lots of indie stuff. 
um maybe some outlast trials so we'll we'll see what happens we'll be doing more comps if your community have any ideas of what torch they like to put you through do not say this out loud <laughs> why would you do this to me they just want to see me eat spicy shit Ugh. oh my god my back oh that felt good Ooh. okay um let's see let's see let's see I talked about tomorrow, and I think that's it. But uh, I guess tonight. So, don't scream was it's interesting. It's a good uh, it's a good prototype. That's the term I used. Um, and I'm interested to see how they move forward with the game. And uh, those left behind was actually pretty fun. It was simplistic, but um, I don't know. I just kind of had a good time with it. It's not often I like to play zombie games anymore. I heard that crack. <laughs> God. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> My poor back. Everything. Dying. Um, so what we're going to do... We're going to actually uh, raid over to our good friends. Not your parents' GNS. Uh, they recently got partnered... So super congratulations to them. Wait till you hear me move. Oh, everything cracks. Oh, God. Um, Not Your Parents GNS is a... Uh, they are... I should say they. They are <clears throat> both uh, CEOs of Screams. Uh, they were added in probably a month or two after like me and Creepy and Cornhusk and everyone else got in. Uh, but yeah, they've been killing it. Absolutely killing it. They have a really cool setup. They both have heart rate monitors. And uh, yeah, really interesting like camera work and like they have like this whole like production thing set up. It's it's a really, really nifty fucking stream. They are playing the new Unfollow demo. We have not played that yet. And I've been hearing very good things about it. We played the original one um, <clears throat> a number of months ago. Uh, for those that don't recall the name, this is the one we're in that kitchen and this big long neck and a giant head at the end just came out from a, like behind a wall. It was really fucking weird. Um, but yeah, that's where we're at. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and pump into chat. Um, damn, I got to update my, I haven't updated these raid messages in a while. I should probably do that. Anyways, the top raid message with the emotes there, that is uh, for subscribers. If you're a current subscriber, you can use that and it'll work. Otherwise, the line beneath that has some generic emotes in there for you to use, or you can use whatever emotes you have. That's cool. <clears throat> um, I'm also on a couple different platforms outside of Twitch. If you want to follow me around there, I am on YouTube where we upload uh, actual Twitch VODs. Uh, unabridged, just kind of pushed right in. <laughs> Uh, I also put up some YouTube shorts on occasion. <clears throat> if you prefer to see those YouTube shorts, but on TikTok, I'm also on TikTok posting that same content. And last but not, well, sorry, not last, is Twitter or X. And I'm on there. I make an announcements there. I uh, uh, post my... Uh, the album reviews that I do for Ghost Cult Magazine. So like heavy metal, hardcore punk, that type of stuff. Excuse me. And, uh, oh, memes, because memes. Uh, <clears throat> last but not least is the Discord server. That's where the Jug Mob hangs out when we're not streaming here in Twitch. It's our home away from home. And uh, we, we watch movies together. We play games together. We watch fucking wrestling matches together. Uh, question, question of the Day bot is like the hottest channel, like, Everyone has these crazy debates, depending on what the question of the day is. Um, and then memes because memes. And also the NSFW memes are out of this fucking world sometimes. Some people, I tell you. Anywho. Let's get this raid kicked off to our dear friends. Not your parents, GNS. There it goes. <clears throat> Uh, thank you all for hanging out tonight. Uh, I had a lot of fun with that challenge to start off the stream. Um, and uh, playing uh, those left behind as long as I did was surprising. Very surprising. I may end up playing that more offline because it's definitely an offline type of game, I feel. 
Um, I don't know if I'll be playing it more on stream or not, but we'll see. If you guys liked it, you let me know. <clears throat> Specifically in Discord or some other platform DM. Don't whisper me here on Twitch. Every time I get a whisper, I think it's bullshit. They're going to be like, hey, I, I watched your stream. What do you think? Oh, it's great, but your artwork sucks. I can, you know, draw you some more shit. And I don't want any of that. That's garbage. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> Shuffle, thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Thank you again for the raid. <clears throat> Kois, I hope you have a good night as well. You absolute animal. You stud. And uh, yeah, I guess I'm going to get out of here. I will see you guys in like uh, 10 hours. Oh, fuck.